What is up, everyone? Let me get the comments rolling here. Hope everyone is having a wonderful evening. David Joseph with Magical here. Got a pretty cool little announcement that um, Megan and I are partaking in for the next 75 days. Uh, we love challenges, and we heard about this one um, from a close friend of ours, Miss Elena McLean. For those of you that have experienced any of our healing ceremonies uh, or have been to the recent retreat, you know Elena. She is an absolute powerhouse. We are going to be going for uh, hard 75. I'm going to explain what that challenge is in just a minute. Um, but we're Magical's putting our own little twist on it, and we're going to be documenting it each day. So um, pretty, pretty pumped for this. We have a ton going on. I know uh, we haven't, I haven't been putting as much content out there. Prepping and getting ready and finalizing everything for the move to Costa Rica has been a lot, <laughs> to say the least. Um, but we couldn't be more excited, couldn't be more grateful for what Magical is going to be creating in Costa Rica, in that space. It's going to be such a beautiful space for healing, and we're going to build the most amazing center for healing out there and everything's moving in the right direction um all right I'm pulling this up getting everything situated it has been like six months since i've done a live on a uh, on Streamyard. <laughs> i think um since the belize healing retreat i haven't been back on since that retreat things have just been flying for magical you know when you take a jump, you take a big step, uh, you take a big risk when the universe puts an opportunity in front of you and you just do it, everything starts falling into place really, really quick. So uh, that's what's been happening for Magical. It's been a, a beautiful experience. So it's been really nonstop. But with this challenge, we're going to be doing a lot more content out there and kind of documenting the whole process. So I'm going to go over what Magical's Hard 75 is. This is a challenge that we're doing for 75 days straight. Um, from what I've heard, this is definitely one of the more difficult challenges out there. And we're going to be totally transparent. There's been, um, for those of you that haven't heard of this, if you look this up, there's been like a, like athletes and stuff that have done this kind of thing. And it's not the physical, it's more the mindset that makes these routines difficult. Um, but we're really excited for it for multiple reasons. So I'm going to go over it. I put it in the notes. So there's the regular hard 75 and magicals. So what magical is going to be doing every Megan and I every single day for 75 days straight. The first thing is our morning routine. So you all know how much we harp on the morning re routine, right? We talk about it all the time, but we're all human. It's easy sometimes to slip out of your morning routine. If in our experience, if you want to manifest the fastest you want to manifest, if you want to really stay in that high vibration, if you want to be the best and most most impactful you can in your day, that morning routine is absolutely vital. I made a post a few days back um, willing to give our morning routine out to anyone that wanted it by email. Although we need to update it, we need to add breath work in there. But the first thing is going to be the morning routine. Our morning routine is going to consist of meditation. It's going to consist of breath work. Um, and it's going to consist of journaling, our gratitude, affirmation, and intention journaling, listening to affirmations uh, while we're doing that. And we're also going to include Reiki. Uh, both Megan and I are Reiki masters. We're going to include Reiki in the morning or before we go to sleep, we're going to include Reiki in there too. So part of this 75-day challenge is literally – doing that morning routine every day for 75 days because it's it's easy to slip sometimes it is for us for anyone you know so i know if we're do if you're doing it 4 or 5 days a week that's that's fantastic but if you can do it 7 days a week this is really going to be a testament to it and we have a lot of massive things coming up with this costa rica move we have the nicaragua healing retreat coming up in november it's already like 60% sold out. We have a lot of different things that are happening. So for us, for the mission that we're on, for the company, for all the people uh, that are either working with Magical or all the people that are coming to Magical for this assistance, it's even more important that we're super in tune, in alignment, 
and in our highest vibration each day, which is what this is going to do. So first one's going to be that morning routine, uh, meditation, breath work, journaling, Reiki every morning. The second part, we're going to be drinking one gallon of alkaline water every day as well. We got our little containers. <laughs> um, we do use Kangen water, but uh, to be to, to, you know, if we're ever not home or something, I'm just going to make it alkaline waters that we're going to drink a gallon of every day. We're going to start off with the King Kangen water, but as the day goes on, if we have to just do alkaline for any reason, I'm going to, I don't want, I don't want to uh, mess this up by being somewhere where I'm not available to get Kangen water. So the second part is a gallon of alkaline water every single day too. And anyone that wants to try and uh, also do this, feel free to jump in, feel free to document everything too, because this is a hell of a, challenge to really get you in that higher vibration and transform. So morning routine is one. Second thing is a gallon of alkaline water every day. Uh, third thing, we're going to be spending 45 minutes in nature every single day. 45 minutes in nature every single day. Um, the next one is going to be a 45 minute workout that challenges us in some way. So 45 minutes of working out every day as well. Um, in the usual hard 75, it's, you read 10 pages a day. We're trading that out and we're putting in 30 minutes of studying Spanish every day, as well as 30 minutes, uh, practicing on a musical instrument every day. So we're dedicating an hour to our creativity. So 30 minutes of Spanish, we're moving to Costa Rica. They speak Spanish. <laughs> so we're going to be studying that to get better at that. And then a musical instrument. We got the chroma drums recently. I have a guitar, that kind of stuff. So uh, the next one's going to be clean eating. We're going to be abiding by a fruitarian um, diet. As most of you know, a fruitarian has been our go-to. So we're a fruitarian, but no cheating. That's the key. Um, no cheating. So we're going to be doing that. And then we're going to be, I'll be doing a daily recap video. You'll be seeing Megan in a few of those. I'm going to get her out here and get her on camera. So um, we're going to be doing a daily recap video every day too um, to recap everything. And we're going to be honest and transparent. So uh, I'm excited for this. I've always been a big advocate of challenges, um, you know, really dedicating yourself to a challenge and no matter what, sticking to it and making it happen. So uh, excited to jump into this. Anyone who uh, wants a copy of what we're doing and wants to try it themselves, Absolutely. Couldn't recommend it enough. I'm excited to go on this journey with you all. Uh, for anyone watching this on StreamYard, there's a little thing at the bottom. I do want to shout out our Nicaragua uh, Healing Island Retreat, Magical's Healing Island Retreat. It's going to be in Nicaragua, November 7th to the 16th. Um, we are, let's see, 8, 9, 10, 11. Uh, yeah, we're about 65, 70% sold out of that. We have three or four private rooms left and four uh, shared rooms left. So um, feel free to message me if you want any info on that. Um, that will be November 7th to the 16th. And couldn't be more of a transformative experience with the medicines we're bringing in, the team we have and all that stuff. So any questions, hit me up and have a blessed night. Happy healing.